for half a century, we have been building devices, either being networking devices or any other devices that we have, as well as applications based on one promise. And the promise has been that the existing security protocols and the algorithms, such as RSA and ECC, are secure for a million of years to come. Well, with the advancement of quantum computers, that promise has been broken. We know that once we have a stable and powerful enough quantum computer, the security of these protocols that we have been relying on and consequently the algorithms will be broken in a matter of maybe a few hours, maybe a few weeks. Now, the question is how we are able to secure the devices, especially the networking devices that are handling large amount of transactions um, over their life cycle um, against this threat. My name is Avesto Jetty. I'm a VP of engineering here at DigiCert, and we are going to answer that question um, in the next few minutes. Now, consider designing and developing um, a networking device, either being a switch, a load balancer, or a router. The first thing comes to mind now is the reliability of that device. But the definition of reliability has evolved over the years. Reliability means that this device is secure against a number of different threats. It has a high availability, and is obviously easy uh, to be deployed in different environments. Now, considering the security aspect, um, this is usually not the first item that comes to mind because we all have believed that the algorithms such as RSA and ECC are protected um, given the complexity of the mathematics that has designed these, these algorithms. Now, quantum computers are going to change this equation. We know that the security of these algorithms are either going to be weakened or they're going to be broken. From a design perspective and following the DARPA's recommendation, which is called security by design, we wanna make sure that the security gets into the cycle of design of these networking equipments um, or whatever else that might be. What we have been doing at DigiCert and as a broader industry um, aspect of this, we have been working on solutions that are capable of securing these devices against the threat of quantum computers. And that's by introduction of post-quantum crypto, which the um, National Institute of the Standard of Technology has been working on for the past seven years. And now we are going through the final stages of this. The solution is quite simple, is basically introducing a new set of cryptographic algorithms in the stack of the development that you're capable of putting on your hardware. Although sounds simple, there are some complexity um, around this, and those complexities could be the uh, limitations of these devices or limitations of the use cases that are there. That being said, the industry is working constantly to be able to make the solutions to be easier to deploy for the manufacturers as well as for the consumers um, in their products. Mm -hmm.